Welcome back, friends. Live at 5 special one today. We wanted to introduce you to our new chief meteorologist, Ted King. Ted, glad to have you with us in Dothan, finally. It is wonderful to be here, I'm telling you. Um, uh, you know, I left temperatures in the 30s and 20s, <laughs> and, you know, I, I got here in the 60s and 70s with the sunshine. Mm -mm. Yeah. But it's, you packed that cold water with you, though, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Some people were thanking me, actually. Some people like this, uh, the chilly weather. They say it's a nice break, but uh, just as long as it doesn't stay around for too long. But, uh, yeah, you know, I left a, a home where the buffalo roam and the deer and the antelope play, and it was snowing when I left last week, wow. driving my U-Haul on down here. Yeah, so this is, uh, this is your, your, this your home where you just left Great Falls, Montana, right? In Great Falls, Montana, yes. This was in September. This was September 28th, so, you know, you guys had a real hot summer down here. I know it was like uh, in the in the upper 90s, even as, as uh, early as uh, late May here. And you yeah, had I think very uh, hot I think even six weeks ago it was 100 degrees. Uh, yeah, so just just that recently. And right. We had a really cool summer up there. Usually it goes to 100 degrees a couple of times. We had, we were in the 90s a handful of times, and we had snow as late as June. And then it started snowing again in September. So while we were chilly up there, you guys were, were sweating it out down here big time. But Certainly were. Well, we've talked, uh, Ted and I, I've got to know each other pretty well in yeah. the past couple of months. But uh, you're going to get the opportunity to know Ted really well. And also, going to debut coming up at 6 o'clock tonight. Yes. And uh, tell us a little bit about your style. We talked about this the other day. You like to educate folks about what, what they see on the weather maps and that sort of stuff. Right, right. I, I like to, you know, I, th I get the impression a lot of people just sit at home and scratch their their head a little bit when they see a weather forecast in general I'm, I'm talking about you know so I like to sort of let you know what's going on I like to, to talk about the jet stream you'll see me talking about the jet stream it has so much to do uh, with the weather that goes on outside your front door especially during the non summer months so uh, we'll talk a little bit about that and I just like to have give people a little bit of an idea of, of what's going on in the atmosphere without it being too complicated for them, you know, that sort of thing. Yeah, great. Well, uh, Ted and his wife just moved to town here. Oh, yeah, and I got to thank my wife. Thank you, Darlene. <laughs> I couldn't have done it without her, man. She's been great. <laughs> she has. And so if you see Ted and Darlene around, uh, maybe at the grocery store or something, make it a point to stop and say hello. And of course, coming up again at 6 o'clock. Ted King taking over the reins of the WDHN Weather Department. Ted, welcome to the team. Welcome to Dothan. Great, You're going to love it here. Great my to be here, man. I'm, I am really excited about it. 